I know mostly all of my stuff is almost 490. I need two more things. I'll be Moo Moo, I don't know why it's not working. I'm sorry. It's that. <laughs> Mama, what are you doing? Yeah, we're getting over a cold in our house too. I like all of December, I feel like each one of us has been sick. Oh. <laughs> like, stop. <laughs> My niece got it first. Turns three in January. Uh oh. I was like, stay away from her. And I was like, well, you can't walk that two year old. I mean, you could, but, you know. For like, for 10 days? No way. Highly looked so down upon. <laughs> <laughs> so I was yeah, like, you know not what? going to uh, go over so well. I was like, whatever. <laughs> I, I'm not going to walk her in there. I'll just. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now I got it. <laughs> if we can pull them in, I could AOE them. That'll help give us some damage on them. I mean, he's healing for quite quite a decent amount too. So. Just went and spent the night at his my husband's mom's place like the beginning of December came home sick and, and then he it. passed it to <laughs> my youngest and then he passed it to me and then oh. we three got over it and then my husband was like oh hey I need to go to the dentist to get a tooth pulled so he goes to the dentist to get a tooth pulled Comes home, next day he's sick, comes up to find out he has a sinus infection and an ear infection. And then just barely get over that. And then Christmas comes around, so then we go to my parents and then to his parents and come home and my youngest is sick. He now has a sinus infection and an ear infection that's going to grow. <coughs> so you're going to get it eventually. Yep. <laughs> I'm fighting it, but, <laughs> um, you know. It, yeah, it yeah, was the, the week before Christmas week. I got a really bad cold. Like, I, holy crap. It was a head and chest cold, and it's like I didn't eat anything. I didn't, I didn't do anything but just sleep. It was the last time... That um, a saber was there. I think it was, it was like the last time I played with you guys before Christmas. Yeah. I think I need to add more into my strength now. My How you were uh... I am, but strength also adds uh, some stuff into it.
So it's like, if I can add, I don't know, get it maybe up to like 40 or something like that, I think I'll be a lot better than what I am. Babe, I don't think it's here. Defeat two summoners here. So I think summoners are. I don't know who they are. says that it's not there. So nothing, I'm gonna take him out. Thank you. I always need the move. Oh, he's not on my desk, bud. I'm surprised we got past this. Oh, I know. <laughs> Dude, well, we almost lost it. I'm surprised we got past right here and the other one. <laughs> that that pink dragon thing, that's what the main or the last boss is gonna do. Yeah, I went from having like 300 health to instantly maxed out. Still not as good, <clears throat> but we'll take it. Take it. Yeah, we'll take it. There we go. I forgot I was specced for my dex build. I was like, why the hell can't I keep freaking aggro? <laughs> That's why. <laughs> I haven't played in like three or four days. 
good. I was getting a little worried. I thought you guys were just No! <laughs> Don't do it! No. <laughs> Oh, he needs to heal me or I'm gonna die. Yep. Oh, he heals me right when I die. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for the... I can keep on getting solid hits on her. I can get those back very quickly. Yeah, one wizard is down. Oh, of course, big boy. And then I missed my shot. been though snark outside of household being sick peachy cane we have like oh i would say eight to ten inches of snow here in idaho so it's pre it's pretty cold it's uh below zero right now so we've been freezing our booties And I thought last night was cold, holy hell. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, our heater in this house, we don't have gas or anything brand, so it's just power. Well, we have a heat pump, and it does not keep this house very warm, so we're running space heaters and all that crap, and, you know, it's a bit chilly. I got another rapier. No, I don't want the rapier. You want this hatchet? It's a 500 gear score and it's plus 24 dexterity. Uh, yeah, actually, after this expedition, I will take it from you. Because we can't, I don't think we can trade it right now, so. Oh, don't forget the chest up here, cars. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. This way. Have you guys been, other than being, you well, know, sick and crazy? <laughs> sick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, honestly, about the same. Haven't really done much. I just work. Yeah. That's about it. Brian was getting a little nervous. Like, no one's oh. answering me. I'm a very nervous human being. <laughs> Very anxious, also. Like, who have you messed with? There's just bubbles, and I was like, I swear. Right there. <laughs> like, why you can do that? Like, somebody will get back to you. Honestly, yeah. uh, once, once Diablo 4 comes out, uh, this game's probably gonna be shelved for a little while. <laughs> right? Because I fucking love Diablo. Did you play Diablo 3 by chance, Cars? Oh, you missed out on such a great game. You gonna hit me in the back like that? Yeah, I told Brian yesterday, I was like, I'm just gonna uh, message Ed and be like, hey, tell your wife to get a hold of me. <laughs> He's like, I don't think that'd go over well. <laughs> You'd be like, who the hell is this dude telling me to tell my wife? <laughs> yeah, I got up this morning and I had fallen asleep really early last night. And I uh, got up this morning and I was like, why do I have all these messages from people? I'm like, oh, oh shit. Oops. <laughs> I was like, I was actually needed last night. The one night that I go to bed early. I'm like, oh well. <laughs> <coughs> I'm 
then I get on and I tell Bubbles, I was like, hey, so uh, we, we apparently were needed last night. And she goes, yeah, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I left my bed. <laughs> All good. Well, then her neighbor, her neighbor's son has COVID. And she was over there, went to the grocery store with him or whatever a couple days before. So now she's starting to get sick and she's like, fuck, I hope it's not COVID. I was like, oh no, it probably isn't here. You know. Your luck. Oh, I'm there. Especially if it was a... Well, I don't know, because if it was a kid that had it, today it's like harder to I was gonna say, oh. you got it. Yeah, I got it from my niece, so I'm not gonna bullshit on that, but. <laughs> I mean, I think this dude's like in his 20s or 30s or something like that, so he, he's a, he's a little. He's been to jail a couple times, I believe. <laughs> so he, he's definitely old enough. But, uh, yeah, she's like, I better not be getting COVID from them people. I was like, oh no, you probably are. Yeah. Like, God, I hope not. Oh, yeah. It all just depends on what your symptoms are, because it's not as bad, but some symptoms suck. Yeah. Like, I never lost my taste. I never had it. I never lost, like, the smell and taste, but trying to lost both. Dude, I, dude, like, mine was, like, mine was bad. I lost taste, smell, I had zero appetite, constant headache, feeling nauseous 24-7. But honestly, though, the last head and chest cold that I got, that was honestly worse than COVID for me. Yeah, symptoms are no i just think it um i just think like it just depends on you know like which one of like which strain out of a million did you get you know hey well and i think the older you are too the more it like affects you yeah well at the same time though like my grandma she's the one that gave it to all of us and like when she went in the doctor and like told her like she was all like, this is it? This is really COVID? I'm 84 <laughs> years old, and this shit is nothing. I was like, you tell him, Grandma. You tell him. You get him. Dude, my uncle found out he had it, and then he still went to my grandma's last night, knowing he had it. Oh, jeez. I was like, bro. Hey, I'm gonna place this. We even went on a cruise to the Bahamas, Mexico, Caribbean, whatever, in 2019, in December, for um, the beginning of December, and came back, and I was like super sick. Didn't have Drink a voice, a I couldn't breathe very well, headache, my ears, everything. And then we had to fly from Florida all the way back to Idaho. So it was a full day of flying, full day, and I was like nauseous, like the whole nine, right? And then we get back and I get over it, and it like went away just as fast as it came on. And I'm like, okay, yeah, sure, fine, like, we're good. Like, it was only me, like, we're good. And then COVID hit, and I was like, hmm, uh, I had all of those <laughs> symptoms, plus many more. <laughs> like, you're welcome, the United States. I was probably the one that brought it back. <laughs> um, patient zero. <laughs> the Caribbean and everywhere, you know. Oh my gosh, it's horrible. Like, I'm patient at. <laughs> Your guys is uh, like... How you guys got it, though, is, like, more reasonable than mine. Mine was in was a uh, asshole company that um, was not telling its employees that 14 of the last 20 had COVID and um, people that were telling them, hey, I have COVID, they were still required to come and work. 
Jeez. And so I found this out, and I go and I ask them about it, and they deny it. But yet again, though, there's only six employees there, and there was 20. Like, things just, like, weren't adding up after a while, because people eventually were just like, no, I'm gonna quarantine, and you guys are gonna pay me. Yeah. That and um, I ended up getting it, and then um, when I had confronted them, when I had, like, confronted them about it, they, like, denied it, and then they fired me. So I was like, okay, well, who's really in the wrong right now? <laughs> wow. They fired me when I had COVID. For getting COVID? <laughs> yeah. That's ridiculous. Yeah. Well, they gave and I was like, <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure you can't do that, but... I was also gonna leave there anyway, so I really wasn't too like pressed about it, but Yeah. And there's like, me, okay. he told me about it and I was like, Oh hell no. Yeah, you were like, <laughs> sue them bitches. I was like, you go in there and sue them bitches. <laughs> like they can't fire you like that. They were also paying me really bad. Like like it was just a job to like get me through until places wanted to start hiring. And then when place started hiring, I was like, yeah, I'm here. There is. No, yeah, there's Nathan. You should have known better than to come here. Get her, Snark. Get her. Yeah. I have minions to deal with whatever flotsam washes in. Actually, she has a bad thing of teleporting on me, so I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> so, as soon as I shot my arrow, she was like, Alright, I'm gonna teleport. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. How did that hit me? I will be behind her, and that still hit me when she shot her gun. Part of that wanted movie. Because I think she's like the one from the head that's close up to her. Right? Yeah. You need to take a shower. <laughs> As soon as she's ready, I'm gonna hit her with a stink bomb. I'm not ever. I thought I hit you with that. She was fine if I did it. Wait, what? What, <laughs> man? Are you guys gonna play Diablo 4 when that comes out? I've never played Diablo. I just, yeah. <laughs> I can't get into the whole camera angle of like oh, looking up above my, yeah. Yeah, I, I mean, it's like, it took me a little while to actually like get used to that too, but once you do, the storyline and all that is so much fun. Yeah, I, I'm i very particular about how I have to view my character when I play games. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I completely bro. understand that. Because I think I was playing ESO at the time, and then like going from ESO to like Diablo, I was like, this is just terrible. After this kitty over here first. Oh, kitty, kitty. Oh, man. Why does kitty want me? Oh, boy. <laughs> I have my hand on E. This is why I wanted to bring a hatchet. As soon as I can do that, I'm going to pull out the hatchet. I got her. I uh, don't got her. No! Holy 
surprised he got wiped. One hour later. Oh, nope, that dog is just for show. Oh. There should be a bag somewhere under this dog. Oh. 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 Now, dude. I don't suppose you need a sword, huh? Ah, dude. Oh, yeah. yeah, I just got a drop of a 500 sword, and I'm using a 600. Oh. Never mind. Wait, so... Uh, <laughs> insignificant sword, okay. So... So now, how do you get watermarks exactly when you do hit six? Pretty much fighting anything, I believe, at the level 60 or higher. Um, and doing the dynasty, or not dynasty, the um, Genesis and Lazarus uh, ones, you get watermark. I watched and... you guys do uh, Genesis when I was extremely sick, and that is a fuck that. Yeah. Uh, you can also get it from... Um, on chest runs and whatnot, anything lootable in in a elite area, okay. will give you watermark. It's easier now because you can see exactly what your watermark is. Before, yeah, good. I feel like I just cannot wait for the next update to come out for this game. Hopefully, yeah. bring in some dual daggers or something. Oh, I just want yeah. a horse. I want a mount so bad. I don't think that's going to be in the that first it's, months. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen until like maybe a year of release. Then I would say probably they'll start bringing them in. Does it cost so much? Does it cost so much anyway? Oh, I know. Apparently, they're supposed to be making it a even amount of Azoth to um, go anywhere, regardless. So faction isn't gonna play into it or anything like that. They're making. A level playing field for everything. I literally, I went from like one end of like an area to the other end of the area. Same area. Awesome. Yeah. I think. <laughs> In the same area? That... Oh, yeah. No, like, um, I needed to go to Windsward, and I was in Hotel, and it, and it was going to cost me 400 Yeah, they, I think they're going to make the overall, um, they're taking the distance part of it out, and they're just making it a flat rate to, tr to travel, and then they're going to make it to where it depends, like, the encumbrance side of things is still going to play effect play a part in it, but it's, they're not going to do it by distance anymore. But if I'm understanding their plans properly. It's supposed to come out either January or February, I don't remember which. I'd probably say February would probably be the better thing, because then the whole winter update's going to end, or, or, or not if they're going to do monthly updates. Yeah, they went from doing them weekly to, I think, every other week now. I don't know if they're going to bump it to monthly or not. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, the whole jumping mechanic in here always makes me angry. I don't feel like I jump, I just feel like I lift my legs up. <laughs> so, kid, jump up. <laughs> I really feel like jumping in this game is when like your kids want to show you something cool and you're like, what the fuck was that? Right? They're like, look what I can do. <laughs> oh, wow. Right? And they do like some like <laughs> little 180 spin and you're like, okay. Thank you. I love it. Or you can't jump <laughs> over a twig, but you can jump 50 feet in the air to grab onto a ledge. That yeah. should not be... <laughs> Something that you can do, but you can do it anyways. Yeah, like, well, I saw a thing that was like, it's because of the armor, that's why the jumping's weird. And I was like, okay, so you're saying it's because of the armor weight, but then I can scale a whole mountainside with armor on? Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that makes sense. I'm rocking like oh. leather and rawhide over here, and you mean to tell me that I can't do that? <laughs> I can't jump on a ledge, but I can jump 15 feet in the air like I'm a superhuman. Is this the boss or anything? Or... Yep, this is the last boss. Oh. Is it just her we gotta fight? Or is there gonna be like ads and shit? She will spawn ads. The first time she was in the air, she spawns ads. And there's like two waves of ads that she spawns. And then when she comes down, she will spawn totems. And those said totems will spawn Whoa. circle dino, or not dinos, dragons that um, uh -oh. Uh -oh. can kill you. I do not know why she wanted me so bad. I'm gonna keep with the bow and arrow. Just a dude playing a dude. The little uh, totems that she spawns will randomly shoot out the purple, pinky dragon thingies. Do we have to destroy those? You can, but. The last time I came through here, when she comes down from floating around in the air, pile up in a corner, that way she puts all the totems in one little area, and then you don't have to worry about them. If not, they will murder you. But I don't know if that's changed, if she tries to put them where you're standing, or... Don't you know. would, like come back over here to where I am? Uh oh, you brought her closer to me. Now when she does that, she can hit me. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! So this mm. is the ad. Oh, okay. Now she's gonna spawn ads. Kill the ads. And then there's the two little totem thingies, pedestals. Those oh, dragons. Oh. And they do that little thing. Time to destroy one of them over here. The ads. Yeah. Those stupid pedestals that. Okay. What are you doing? That comes down so we all get in the corner, right? He's coming down. These things have a lot of health to them. Oh, Out of the pink lines. Does that hurt? <laughs> Egg, no! I thought that's what she said. <laughs> yeah. It always packs me up when we're in here. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, the eggnog got me. 
because I hate eggnog. I can't stand eggnog. But Eddie loves eggnog. I'm like, I can't. Blech. I feel like you either love it or you know, there's like no in between. Yeah. I used to be able to drink it until I got really sick and then smelt it and now I can't. I can't. It, it. <laughs> Now, oh Jesus, where are you going, stupid thing? Now it's just a DPS race to try and get it down. <laughs> Believe me, I'm doing everything I can being a bow guy. Because if I get up close, he's gonna fuck me up. This just might be the first time we make it through on the uh, first go round. I probably some wood for you. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be as close as I am to her. Well, you also don't have any kind of range to attack, do you? Yeah, yeah. You know that meme where like the house is burning oh, around him, and he's like, "This is oh, fine." God. Oh god. That's okay. Okay, I come over here to get away from you, but you follow me. I don't understand. I mean, I have aggro on her completely this whole entire time. I don't know why. This does not. They made her so freaking easy. I say that. She says. I, <laughs> I was gonna say she says <laughs> as she dies. <laughs> oh, we did it! Only took us thirty runs. <laughs> Give me the bow. Give me the bow. I just want the bow. Drop me the bow, and you do not drop me the bow. Take a hammer. I got some ice gauntlets. That is going to legitimately do me no good. I have so many of these freaking jade collar things. Ay, ay, ay. Never get the armor I need, and it bugs me. We'll just think about it. Here in four more levels for you, these guys, uh, as long as we get them the maps, they can make us whatever we want. All right, now let's go turn in all these quests. I think the other bitch was harder than the last one. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's just because of them, those dogs. If it wasn't for those dogs, it would have been an easy run through. All right, guys, thanks for watching another one. We finally got through the Neatness. excavation with Snarg's help. So thank you, Snarg. And we'll catch you in the next one. Peace. Okay.